Hello again, this is Shay Godwin. I'm a Los Angeles-based session drummer, and I'm here again to talk about online drum tracks, getting, on, uh, getting drum tracks from an online session drummer over the internet. Uh, today's subject, communication. A little background. The music industry is changing. It's hard to see where things are going sometimes, but something that I see as a lasting trend for sure is the trend toward online recording. Getting drum tracks, bass tracks, or keyboard tracks, or any other instrument you need from an online session musician. Um, and uh, aside from the obvious uh, reason of the technological advancements we've had in recent years and will continue to have, the reason I see this as a lasting trend is that it's popular because of the cost effectiveness. It saves, people's, saves people money. It's generally less expensive to hire an online studio drummer than to pay under traditional circumstances. Um, the owner of a studio to rent the space, a producer, engineer or engineers, cartage, meaning the people who move the, the percussion and drum equipment to the studio, and the drummer, etc., etc. Uh, so uh, this is a, a, a la going to be a lasting trend, and there's already uh, many options for getting drum tracks online from an online session drummer. A lot of websites offering the service. Um, and uh, as a session drummer, I've moved in the direction of offering drum tracks uh, online to uh, clients. And indeed, uh, these days, most of my session work is uh, uh, from clients around the world over the Internet. Most of my clients are Internet clients from around the world. Uh, now, um, on the different websites, uh, different drum track websites, there's definitely varying levels of communication as far as the interaction between the session drummer and the client. Okay? Definitely varying levels of interaction. When I first began doing this, I missed the interaction of the traditional studio setting. Um, it's always been fun for me to go into the studio and interact with the artist, the songwriter, the producers, etc. Uh, I also enjoyed the pressure of being up against the clock, the studio time, and the teamwork required to get the job done and the camaraderie that came about. The feeling of camaraderie, uh, as you work with people toward a common musical goal. I missed that. Uh, and my clients were always really happy with the results, but I missed the interaction, and whether they realized it or not, I imagine they missed it too, uh, whether they realized it or not. Uh, so I have taken to communicating with clients via Skype. Uh, sometimes I chat, but usually Skype. And this has really changed uh, my level of satisfaction uh, with the process. Um, and the process should be fun. The process should be fun. Uh, and it's a lot more fun for me and I think for my clients too. Uh, uh, my longtime clients are telling me that they're having a lot more fun these days using Skype because uh, they're like, it's like they're in the same room when we're discussing things and they can play something on guitar for me and we can sing drum parts back and forth with each other uh, and come up and, and uh, interact musically, which is what I missed about the traditional studio setting, and uh, so now I'm getting that back with uh, using Skype and, and, and uh, communicating with people. Uh, now, again, these different uh, drum track sites, uh, there's a lot of them, and the communication level is different on a lot of them, and I've seen some that are just, you, um, you fill out a form about what kind of style you want it played. You want it not busy, a little bit busy, very busy. Questions like that that I don't think really can do your music justice. I think your music deserves a better level of communication and interaction than that. So, as you shop around, choose wisely and consider that uh, in terms of uh, your decision-making process about who's going to make your custom drum tracks for you. Uh, uh, aside from the ob other obvious uh, considerations, uh, the level of playing, obviously, and the drum sounds being achieved, of course, and all that stuff, but also consider the level of communication, because uh, that's very important. So I hope that helps, and until next time, have a great one.